Caldecott Preparatory School is a prep school for boys age 713 in southern Buckinghamshire, England. About Caldecott Caldecott Preparatory School was founded in Hitchin, Hertfordshire in 1904 by James Hield Jenkins, who named his school after his new bride, a Miss Theodora Caldecott Ingram. There were just eight boys. In 1938 the school moved to its present site in Farnham Royal in Buckinghamshire, and became a charitable trust in 1968 under the headmaster at the time Peter Wright. Today there are around 250 boys. The school's governors include past parents, old boys and headmasters of public schools. According to the school's website, many pupils at Caldecott subsequently win places at major independent schools, such as Eton College, Harrow School, Lansing College, Winchester College, Stowe School, Tonbridge School, Marlborough College, Wellington College, Haley Berry College and Radley College. The original Victorian house remains. New buildings have been created around it to provide more contemporary facilities. In 2004 the Centenary Hall was completed to provide a theater for drama and music and a venue for functions. Currently underway is construction on a permanent, modern roofing fixture over the swimming pool to provide year-round swimming for the boys. Although central London is only 20 miles, 32 kilometers away, the school has 40 acres, 16 ha of grounds and playing fields. Burnham Beaches, a national nature reserve owned by the City of London Corporation, is adjacent to the grounds and is often used by pupils. Heathrow Airport is 7 miles, 11 kilometers away. Recent updates The school has undergone developments in recent years, primarily due to the change in headmaster. In April 2017, Simon Dogart, who was headmaster of Caldecott for two decades, retired due to ill health. Subsequently he died on 23 July 2017 in East Winter in Chichester, with his family by his side. He was replaced by acting head, Roshi Neadu, before Jeremy Banks was appointed as the new permanent headmaster in April 2018. Jeremy Banks was educated in an all-boys prep school in Nottingham and also boarded in Uppingham. After attaining a degree in geography and education from the University of Warwick, he was appointed as a teacher at Dulwich Prep. After 10 years at Dulwich, he became deputy head of Beachborough School in 2006, later becoming headmaster in 2013. He was successful during his time as head, with the school gaining record numbers as well as the record for senior school scholarships being broken every year he served as headmaster. In 2010, Banks completed a master's degree in educational leadership distinction and is currently a member of the Independent Association of Preparatory Schools, IAPS, as well as chairman of the Education Committee. Banks has implemented changes to the school in his time in charge, notably the removal of Saturday school for years 3 4 and the inclusion of flexi and occasional boarding for boys in years 3 6. Caldecott has suggested that these changes maintain the tradition of the school, while making it more inclusive for parents and an easier transition for boys. In Tackler's recent school guide, they cited the new deputy head structure, having a separate deputy head for pastoral, academic and management was raising the profile of academics and enhancing well-being provision. The guide goes on to mention that Caldecott has a 100% common and trans success rate which results in high-profile scholarships for many of the boys. Awards and commendations In recent years Caldecott has won, and been in contention for, a number of high-profile awards across a range of fields. Some of these include Independent School of the Year for Sporting Provision, 2019 Independent Prep School of the Year, 2020, finalist. Best Head of Prep School, Jeremy Banks, 2020. Further to this, the school's most recent inspection by the Independent Schools Inspectorate included the following comments. Pupils achieve high standards across the curriculum, and build knowledge and understanding in all areas of learning. This is partly due to the exemplary attitudes of pupils and their overwhelming enthusiasm, as well as excellent teaching and well-planned lessons.
They, pupils, display a profound sense of awe in the joy of learning and the opportunities that are afforded them across school life. The joy of life permeates the school. Core Values The school has a set of five core values used as an anchor to nurture Caldecott boys into well-rounded young men. Perseverance, integrity, courage, compassion, humor. In recent years, these values have come to the forefront, as seen by their number Caldy Gold campaign. On the school website, they also state that these words are used as an inspiration and an anchor, ensuring everything they do is in the best interest of the boys. This goes hand in hand with the school's focus on developing sound character and well roundedness in the, their pupils, rather than solely relying on strong academic results. Historic Sex Abuse On the 30th of September 2008, the school was the subject of a feature documentary, Chosen, transmitted on Morphor as part of the Real Stories Strand, about the sexual abuse that went on at the school during the late 1960s and early 1970s. The headmaster Peter Wright was active in this, as well as a number of other teachers, targeting boys good at sports and, to a lesser extent, in the choir. In The Guardian published on the same day, a former parent alleged that Lord Justice Scott Baker former chairman of the Board of Governors, and headmaster Simon Dogart mishandled a case of alleged sexual abuse of their son by a teacher in the early 2000s. Martin Carson was dismissed for sexual abuse of a pupil in 1972 and went on to teach at Chelmsford Hall School in Eastbourne, eventually becoming involved in the founding of the Herodian School which was his last employment in education. In 2003 following the Channel 4 broadcast of an interview with two victims he was arrested in charges and pleaded guilty to charges assault and possessing indecent images of children in 2003.0n. The 4th of December 2011, Peter Wright and Hugh Henry, Another teacher, were charged with child sex offenses alleged to have taken place between 1959 and 1970. For Henry, the charges cover his period at Gayhurst School as well as at Caldecott. They appeared in court in Aylesbury on the 21st of December 2011 charged with a total of 35 offenses against 12 pupils. This was the second time that Peter Wright had been charged for child abuse offenses. The first time, in 2003, the judge awarded a stay of proceedings predicated upon the passage of time since the offenses were allegedly committed. Hugh Henry was found guilty of 11 counts of indecency, and two of gross indecency, towards a child, and pleaded guilty. He was killed by a train shortly before he was due to return to court for sentencing, his death a presumed suicide. On the 18th of December 2013 Peter Wright was convicted of sexually assaulting five pupils aged 8 to 13 at Caldecott between 1959 and 1970. Wright was sentenced to eight years imprisonment on the 6th of February, 2014.Thames Valley Police on the 1st of May 2012 charged another former teacher, John Utterson, with sexual offenses committed against children at the school between 1979 and 1981. Addresson was subsequently further charged with child sex offenses committed at Moore Park School near Ludlow, Shropshire, between 1985 and 1988. He pleaded guilty and was sentenced to five years prison but wasn't fined. A further ex-teacher, David Geddes, was also charged in November 2012 with four charges for offenses against three schoolchildren between 1975 and 1977. Under ex headmaster Simon Dogart, another incident of alleged child sexual abuse was reported. The headmaster and the chairman of the Board of Governors, Lord Justice Scott Baker, suspended the teacher, who did not return. Houses Each pupil in the school is a member of one of four houses. These are Cooper, named after John Shuel Cooper, the school's fourth headmaster, Jenkins, named after Heald Jenkins, the founder and first headmaster, MacArthur, named after Harry MacArthur, an influential Lay's parent who aided the school financially, Wood, named after F. Gordon Wood, the third headmaster of the school. Notable alumni John Apthorpe, founder of B Jam Foods, now Iceland and Wizard Wines, 
now Majestic Wines Ben Castle, British jazz musician, the son of entertainer Roy Castle. Nick Clegg, former Liberal Democrat MP for Sheffield Hallam, leader of the Liberal Democrats and Deputy Prime Minister of the United Kingdom. Rodney Craig, British fencer who competed at the 1968 and 1972 Summer Olympics. Robert Diamond, singer-songwriter of pop band Tempo Shark Alex Farkerson, curator and art critic, director of Tate Britain Will Oi, Decked, 2001, British touring car champion 1991 Tanku Has Anil Ibrahim, regent and crown prince of Pahang, Malaysia Ralph Izzard, journalist for the Daily Mail Adrian Jarvis, Harlequins FC rugby union player, selected for England Saxons 2008 squad Malcolm Lowry, poet and novelist Wilfred Lowry, Birkenhead Park FC rugby union player, and England player, Brooks Newmark, former Conservative MP for Braintree and former Minister for Civil Society Ernest Saunders, former Chief Executive of Guinness 1981-86, best known for being one of the Guinness 4, Chris Shiasby, England Rugby Union player Ed Stoppard, actor Andrew Strauss, England cricketer and captain. References External links, Independent School Inspection Report on Caldicott, PDF. February 2012. The Ilsted Care Inspection Report on Caldicott, PDF. November 2011. Archived from the original PDF on the 4th of March 2014. Retrieved the 4th of March 2014.